Welcome back, everybody. Tomorrow, everybody's golf on PlayStation 4. Green Country Club today. Regular tees, normal cups. Club skill high. Carrying on our little series. We're back onto some of the easier courses. So let's see how we do. It's a green. Pretty green course. Thank you very much. Uh, pretty straightforward, really. Not many difficult holes. But again, this is all about precision. It's all about putting the ball on the fairway. Getting a good approach to the pin. Leaving ourselves a super easy putt. So 126 to go. Bit of wind. Cheeky little eight iron up there. Yeah, I got that close, I'll do. Five foot for the birdie. So I think my previous best score on it is 17, but we found birdie on everything. We found a few eagles as well, but that'll be my customs. So two, a little bit of a dog leg, but at the re the range. I was going to say at the um, the length we're hitting, can't actually take advantage of that. With the custom clubs, you can cut the corner a bit, but worth the power shot on the fives. Just to try and shorten that second shot as we can. 178 to go. That's going to be a 5 iron into the pin. That's not awful. Hang on, what does it do when it lands? It is going to go a little bit there. Okay. Wind just went up a touch. That's too short, I think. Oh, nice shot. That's going to land in a little bit of rough. Ah, it's frustrating. Knew it the second I hit it. So, we've got a chip for the eagle, not a putt. Good, good. Oh, pace was spot on to the line, let me down. Still, we'll get the birdie, but there was an eagle to be had there. If we'd have found the green properly, which we should have done, we'd have got there. It feels like a shot dropped. So three. Again, what's the green doing when you land on it? So it is going to kick left. Okay. A little bit downhill, a little bit downwind. Five iron though, so it only impacted a little bit. Yeah, we just come up a bit short. Oh, this is a tricky pup. This is a tricky putt. So it breaks a lot at the start and then straightens out. Ah, oh, we didn't have counter enough. No. No. Oh, that feels like another drop shot. So that's two mistakes. Uh, four. Not a lot you can do here. you just got to hit up to this bit. You can't really get around that corner easily. Well, you can thrash it and end up in the rough. But that's not going to help you. So, 110 left. Little bit uphill, little bit upwind. Right, looks like a better shot, doesn't it? Back on the birdie trail. <laughs> so five bends around the corner, but again, you can't really take much advantage of it. Just gotta hit it and get it up there. Great shot. So 115 to go. Pitching match it takes the wind a little bit more. I uh, didn't really for that. Short and left. Left is a difficult birdie putt. 
sloping uphill. It's totally all right. Oh, that's a tricky part. Just missed it. Ah, uh, that approach shot was just untidy. Three under. It's a six. For some reason, the T's pointing the wrong way, but this is just a big booming T shot. And a little bit uphill to the green. So 72. Green's not going to do a lot. Ooh. That's not bad. Oof. Nearly faded my thought. Four under. Seven's the par three. It's a bit down over, but it's not, not necessarily hard on this at the front. So we might have to play a bit of backspin here. Did we get enough on it? Ah. Uh, not quite. Still, we got the birdie pup. Bad tee shot, good pup. Five under. Eight, super wide fairway here. Be a little bit daring. Cut a little bit off. Use the power shot because I've plenty of these left. Don't really need it, but it might just shorten it up a little bit. It's a 75. Uh. Ah. A little bit short. Yeah, made up with the putt though. Six under, and then a par five to finish it. Oh, it's a par five. So just got to hold for the water, really. Not that you can out drag it anyway. So 170 left. A little bit close to the front edge. I'm not sure it's going to worry me though. Oh, a lot of left hand shots, right? So we get the eagle pup. Get in there. Oh, needed that. That gets us to eight under. Some modicum of respect. Those two pars, though. See what we can do on the way back. It's a powerful. It's a ten. Uh, into the wind. I'm not quite going to get it over that little lump, am I? Sometimes when it's downwind, you can get it to bounce off the back slope. This will kind of struggle. Nah, it's just going to stall at the top of the hill. 85 to go. Into the wind. What's it going to do when it lands? Okay. Oh, wind really caught it. It's much too short. Okay. Need a bit of chip magic. Hey, hey! Love it when you pull those off. Oh, 
There we go. Eleven. Again, can't really take too much advantage of the the bend. Just gonna get it up there. Give ourselves a good second shot. Eighty-five to go. What's it gonna do when it lands? Gonna go left. Okay. Champion and stop. Uh, it's okay. It's a bit further than I would have liked. Got it though. Just correct in. Ten under. Par three next. Twelve is an awkward little mugger. It's such a long way downhill, and it's downwind in this case. Always unsure as to how much to take off it. You've got to clear that front edge. Good, good. No, that's not bad. In you go. Nice birdie. So 11 under. 13's the par 4. It's a par Again, you've got no real no real ability to drive it up there. With the customs, you can drive the green here. Which is where the eagle came from. It's short, but not short enough. Got it close up there, though. 45 to go, so it's worth the power shot to get it super close. And again, going to add a bit on for the slope. Oh, that's not bad. In the middle of the hole. 12 under. Par 5 next. Probably worth the power shot here. Not the ultra topspin. Maybe that bigger bounce. Now, can we hit the approach close to the pimp? Oh, way left. And a bit short. It's on the surface, though. So we get the eagle pub. Looks like it slopes up. Somewhere around there. Oh, just low. <sighs> we'll get the birdie, but that was close to the eagle. If it had been a couple of feet closer, I might have made that. It's a 15. Again, a really undulating fairway. And we get a good bounce here. There you go. So that leaves me 85. That's okay. Just got it. Fourteen. Three, four, five to finish. The little little map of Africa home. So we're down in sort of Zimbabwe, I think. 
So hard to get these close. Because it's just the crown of the green just takes it away from the pin. Yeah, it looks just goes left on you. It's going to be a tricky part. Looks like it slopes up. Oh, <laughs> oh, just the pace let me down. Took another par. It really didn't feel good. And again, all about how cheeky you're feeling here. There is a shot where you can bounce it off the back side of that hill, get a bit more distance, but it's a little bit risky. We're all about fairways and greens today. Eighty to go. I've had quite a few close to the front. They're kind of hard to get to, especially when it's elevated. Oh, what a beauty! Well, it's a good job I was close because that's a nasty bit of um. Putting surface. Eighteen. Go on then. A lot of right hand shots away, but it's alright. Nearly got three hundred. Two fifteen to go. Let's try. And get it up there. No, it's just gone left, hasn't it? Uh, oh, that's enough. Oh, well, oh. Don't let the eagle slip. Sloping downhill. Oh, it's super tough to know where to put this. Oh, keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh, not quite. Look how far it's going to run past, though. Almost like a gassy. Still got the birdie, though. Looks like it slopes up. In the hole. So we ended up with 16 under. Ah. I've done better. I've done worse. Those pars didn't beat our best score. Yeah, let's have a look at the stats. Yeah, okay, every fairway missed one green. Can't argue with that. Hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please like, share, and subscribe. Please uh, leave me a message. And I'll see you next time for a bit more of everybody's golf.